do you want to know how to dip? Well, you better pay me money or pay me attention. Let's go. First things first, let's go ahead and line up your lunges. These are your reverse lunges. What you're going to do is you want to go ahead and line your body up over the foot that's in the front. We want to put our nose over our knee, our knee over our toe. And that's how we maintain balance. As that foot is rolling back, you want to make sure that you continue to stay on your toe as you lift your heel. All right, so once you got that, that lunge together, that reverse lunge together, the next thing you want to do is you want to make sure that that foot that goes back, very important. We want to be able to pivot on its toe 90 degrees. Again, we want to make sure that we are pivoting on this toe 90 degrees. See that? Bow. And then the reason why we're pivoting on that 90 degrees is so that way we can pull ourselves back. Pull ourselves back back to the foot that's behind us all of our weight again is on that foot that's in the front as we pull ourselves back to the foot that's in the back try not to pay too much attention to my upper body right now that's not as a i mean that's not as relevant until we get to this next step which is right now all right so what we want to do is we want to open up our chest towards that foot that's going back so wherever foot is going back that's the side that our chest open up towards all right, I call it the open book, baby. Let's open that book. Bow. Open that book. Bow. All right. Now, use your upper body, your head. Use your head to see where you're going, to see what you're doing. Don't just keep your head forward until you get to that advanced level. Right now, as we're learning this, just make sure that your head swivels with your upper body. Now, as you're doing it, one puts together steps one, two, and three. And we want to make sure that we pull ourselves back as we're doing it. Next thing is we want to tell a story. All right. So what is your upper body saying? I'm going to show you guys how to do this backstroke. But before we do this backstroke, I want you guys to hold this cup of water. Uh, hold this cup of water. Use one hand, swing it back into a backstroke, bring it up to a cup of water. And then once you get comfortable with that, you can go ahead and eliminate that water cup hold. And just go ahead and start skating backwards with it backstroke 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 you see what i'm saying once you guys have that you're pretty much dipping but let's go ahead and add some uh some flair to it because it's very important that you guys get to where you guys want to get to and this is how we add the flare as you guys notice my right foot is just going to slide or stay in one position all right the other foot is going to rotate back behind it and as i'm still continuously opening up my chest and closing it back up by bringing my foot that's in the front back towards the foot that's in the back right the foot that's in the back it just pivots and pivots it pivots out pivots back in pivots out then pivots back in it pivots out and then it pivots back in and ladies and gentlemen there you go you have the dip congratulations all right so go ahead and take this to any of your local skater rings bring it to the park let me see you guys hit that joint remix this let me see your dip baby let me see your dip and that my friend is how to dip so 